are you all doing today? Guess what? Today, we are going to learn about the five senses together. Our five senses are seeing, hearing, smelling, tasting, and touching. Are you excited to learn more about them? Well, let's go then! Sight. We are able to see with our eyes. Being able to see is really important. Sight allows us to connect with all the things around us. And they keep us safe and away from danger. Sight can be also used for fun things like... Give me some examples. Yeah! It can also be used for watching cartoons or shows. It helps us understand it better, right? Or we can use our sights to see beautiful things like our nature, the sun and the moon, or the ocean and beautiful trees and flowers. Seeing, 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 hearing. Do you guys hear that? We use our two ears to hear. Hearing is really important. By hearing, we can talk with our families or friends. We can hear the shows that we are watching. That way, we will understand what is going on in the show. Oh, and when mommy or daddy is telling us a bedtime story, we can understand the story by listening to them with our ears. Two ears. We can also use hearing to listen to music and songs. Oh, I love songs. Which one is your favorite? Hearing. Hear. Ink. Hearing. Smell. Do you guys smell that? It smells delicious. Do you guys know how we are able to smell? That's right! We are able to smell with our nose. Did you know that being able to smell is a really good thing? We may not need it, but it's a good thing that we have it. By smelling, we can smell things like delicious food, or the ocean, or beautiful flowers. And there's lots and lots more. Give me some examples. Yes! By smelling, we can also smell the weather. When it's raining or snowing or when it's sunny, the weather has different kinds of smell. Isn't that cool? Did you know that smelling can also stop you from being in danger? Like when you smell food and it does smell really bad. Maybe it's expired or not healthy. That way, you can stop from eating bad food and you won't get sick. When you have a cold, your nose will be really, really stuffy. So that way, you can't really smell things. But it's all right. You should take care of yourself and that way, you will get better and will be able to smell again. Smelling. Smell-ing. Smelling. Touch. Do you like hugging your friends or family? Well, I do. We are able to do that by having the sense touch. We can tell how things are shaped and feel by touching them. Isn't that cool? 
Though sometimes we might not like the things we touch. Maybe they're slimy, or you might just not like them. There are different types of feelings when we touch. For example, there is soft, like really fluffy and soft cats. Oh, did you know that we can also tell the temperature of things with our hands? Lie. When you put your hand next to a heater, you can tell how hot it is, right? Or when you're building a snowman and it's cold, you can feel how cold it is and your hands start freezing. Isn't that cool that we can tell how hot and cold things are by touching them? Oh look, this cat is so fluffy and soft. I love cats. Do you? They're really cute and soft. Touching. Touch. Ing. Touching. Taste. We are able to taste with our tongue. It's good to have the sense taste. That way, you can taste all the delicious food candy, or try different flavors like sour, or spice, and even junk food. I love having the sense taste. It's a really good thing. Tasting. Taste. Ing. Tasting. Do you guys smell that? It smells really good. Let's find what it is. Oh, it is the carrot. It looks really good. Should we taste it? It tastes really, really good. And? has a really, really crunchy sound. Do you guys hear that? And it's really, really hard. See, that's how we use all of our five senses for everything. Congratulations, you made it to the end. I hope you enjoyed learning about all the five senses with me. Now, you know all of them. There are hearing, seeing, smelling, tasting, and touching. Five senses. I will see you soon. Oh, and don't forget to like and subscribe to N and Kids. And don't forget to turn on the notification bell. Goodbye.